Hey Harvest Time, it's me Eliza again and welcome to this week's edition of Harvest Time News. If this is your first time with us, welcome and we are so glad that you are here and we would love to connect with you. So please take a moment to fill out our connection card which is located in your program. On the back of this card is our prayer request section. If you have any needs, please fill it out and simply drop it in the offering basket as they go by. Also, we have a gift for you. A book entitled, Since Nobody's Perfect, How Good is Good Enough by Pastor Andy Stanley. Please pick up your copy at the Welcome Center on your way out. Tuesday night at 7 p.m. is Christian Life Night. In the sanctuary, we have Pathway. Pathway is a ministry that helps us overcome obstacles that keep us locked into old hurts, hang-ups that keep us from moving forward, and habits that control us. In addition to our 12-step group, Pathways has recently added an open group as well. All are welcome each week on our journey to wholeness. And for all of our college students, we have the abstract, where students can come and discuss issues relevant to their stage of life in a small group setting, we meet in the prayer room. Wednesday night at 7 p.m. is Family Life Night. We have the Book of Revelation, which meets in the sanctuary. Enjoy worship, fellowship, and live teaching in this verse-by-verse -verse exploration of the Bible's final book. In the prayer room, we have Fresh Look, where we'll be taking a fresh look at Jesus, a fresh look at the Bible, and a fresh look at the church. At the lower level, we have Royal Rangers and Missionettes for children in preschool through sixth grade. Here students will learn biblical truths and will develop godly characters through Christian mentorship. Nursery, as always, is available. The current student ministries meets in the dome for all students from seventh through 12th grade. TCSM meets each week to build relationships, to engage in worship, and to hear a challenging message. This Thursday, all young adults are welcome to come to a night of worship. If you are between the ages of 18 and 29, you're invited to come and worship God with us. We will begin at 6.30 in the Dome. On Friday at 10.30, we have Prime Time, our ministry for people 60 and older. Join us for Bible study, worship, and prayer. On May 30th and 31st, we invite you to our event, The Art of Marriage. I'm Wendy. I'm Chad, and we're from Little Rock. I thought it has been superb how all the different um, theologians, pastors have all echoed one another, and uh, all the things that they've said come straight out of Scripture, but to flesh that out in real life relationships, it's been neat to see the different examples uh, presented so creatively. So I've loved it. I've laughed. I've cried. I walk away and just say, you know, on a daily basis, does our marriage really tell the truth about God? to a watching world, I sure pray that's the case for us. Well, I, I definitely sense an elevated responsibility of being the husband and being more than just a good husband, but uh, just raising the bar, and, and I, need to, I need to go for it. Well, it. It's, to me, being on video, I had this expectation that it would be kind of a, a lecture video. You mm -hmm. take your notes, you grab the high points, fill in the blanks, and it's much more than that. It's, it's engaging, it's funny. It's, it's an experience. Yeah, it's, it's so much better than a class. It, it's, it's truly, uh, I, I feel it's a getaway. When we left last night, I kind of like, well, we should be going to our hotel, <laughs> not home. Uh, Fresh. It's uh, challenging. It's good, it's very good. That's three words. That's fine. <laughs> <laughs> if you are interested, you can register by visiting the Welcome Center or use the easy links on our website. If you have any questions, please feel free to stop by our Welcome Center and pick up some information. Or you can visit our website at htchurch.com and follow our Facebook and Twitter pages for all of our church updates. That's it for this week's edition of Harvest Time News. God bless and see you soon.